Hi and welcome. Today we're going shopping at Walmart and we're going to check out their dahlias as well as many other flowering bulbs and bare roots. So here we start with the Bonita Harmony Mix Gladiolus. Dearly Beloved Mix. Beautiful white. Endless Summer Mix. Which has got a nice array of colors. A Summertime Mix. Some nice bright colors and the Radiance Mix, and the French Macaron Mix, and what is else we have down here is the Hello Sunshine Mix. Lots of yellows in there. Very pretty. And then over here they've got some Dahlias, Kevin Floodlight, and this Border Mix of smaller Dahlias, this Motto, Dahlia, the Duet Dahlia, and then here's a Canna Wyoming, and a Frasia Single Mix, a Canna Crimson Beauty, and a Dahlia Lucky, Lucky Number. Then we've got Canna Pretoria, Dahlia Electric Flash, and then this Dahlia here, Fern Cliff Illusion. And up here we've got more cannas, Lucifer, and some begonias, Picote Pink and White, and Pendula Yellow, and then some Caladiums, Carolyn Wharton, Blaze, a mix, and Candidum. Then this beautiful Pink Beauty Astilbe, this gorgeous begonia fragrant inspiration, Calla Lily Ambon. Asiatic Lily Perfect Joy Mix, Gladiolus Defiant Mix, Daylily Dress Pink, and this Peony Vivid Pink, a Lily Fragrant Bouquet, and this beautiful Gladiolus Pretty in Pink. So they have this Dahlia Alva Supreme, which I grew last year, and the Dahlia Vancouver, this Happet Blue Eyes, which was another one I grew last year, this Felita Solar Flare, and this White Perfection Dahlia, beautiful, this Holland Festival, and the Penn Hill Watermelon, which I also grew last year. And then this Dazzling Magic. And a Lily Big Brother. A Red Morning. Another Dahlia Akita. And then this Big Red Dahlia. Beautiful. More Lilies. Beijing Moon. Leslie Woodruff. Rising Moon. And Robert Swanson. And some Echinacea, Purple Coneflower, a Daylily, Stella Dioro, as well as Grape Magic. And then some Bleeding Hearts. And some Hollyhock Black. This is one I bought last year, but only one survived for me. Um, this Blue Sea Holly. Uh, yellow Hollyhock. Some Asiatic Lily Mix, a Stargazer Lily, um, a Hollyhock in Pink, and a Hollyhock in Red. That's quite pretty. I love the doubles on that. This gorgeous Dahlia Creme de Cassis, and this mix of Dinner Plate Dahlias, a Zingaro, Twinning Smarty, Pacific Time, and Pacific Ocean. Some gladiolus at night, a mix, the pastel mix, the red, white, and blue mix. And then some bare root clematis, city of lion, HF young, venosa violacea, blackberries and cream daylily, final touch daylily, little missy, Night Beacon, and Once in a Lifetime. Some Irises, Caesar's Brother, Full Tide, Cherub's Smile, 
Handsome Hostas, Patriot, Olive, Bailey, Langton, Minuteman. And then we have here some more lilies. Durango, Forever Susan, an Oriental Mix, and some more Stargazers. Lily of the Valley um, in white and pink. Some Tricertus, Herda, and Blue Wonder. Radecchia, Goldstrom, Phlox, Orange Perfection, and a Mix. And a Peony Sorbet. Some Bleeding Hearts in Pink, Luxuriant, and Alba, a Still Be in Sunny Boy, Red Sentinel, and Chocolate Kiss, and some Columbine. Some more Daylily, El Desperado, Pardon Me, Stella D'Oro, Echinacea Butterfly Mix, some more Blue Sea Holly, and some Ferns Christmas, Cinnamon, and Tennessee Ostrich. And then some more lilies. We've got the Double Tiger Orange, the Dolly Madison, the Centerfold, Casablanca, a Lily Bold Mix, some more Leatris, a Red Hot Poker, and some Poppies, a Mix, and a Red One, and some Peonies, Bowl of Beauty, Felix Kraus, Festiva Maxima, and Margaret Truman. And they had a wide variety of large planters in many different colors. And then way in the back, they had tomato cages. So you may want to check that out. So I ended up picking up these French macaron mix of gladiolus. And I noticed when I got home that these already had started sprouting in the bag. Um, probably because they were warm in the store um, but I ended up getting more because the ones I planted last year actually overwintered in my garden and I wanted to add more so I also picked up this clematis HF young um, so I opened up the bag when I got home so you can take a look at what the um, bare root looks like on this and it actually was sprouting already a little bit um, but I'm gonna pot this up right away so that I don't end up losing it like I lost a lot of the bare roots last year so thanks for joining me in this shopping trip and I hope to see you again next time bye